What's up, Phoenix? It's your boy, Monty. Day one of Phoenix Comic Con, and I'm here with... I'm Gabrielle Abrams. Gabby, what do you think of the con so far? So far, well, I haven't been too much, but it seems like there's a lot of people this year. It seems like, it just seems like it's like more and more people coming every year. And there is, they, they sold out a full event passes. Oh. So, it's going to be busy this year. Yes, yes. Thursday's the calm before the storm. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah. So, tell me about your Throwback Thursday cosplay. I am Gadget Hackwrench from uh, Chippendale Rescue Ranger. Yes, yes. Now, my favorite character. Now, <laughs> for you your youngins, Google it, <laughs> Watch pop, it, YouTube, all over, and you'll figure out her character is... One of the best yes. ever. So, what, what gave you the idea to do this cosplay? Um, I was just trying to figure out cool, unique ideas, and different ones that I don't see around here and pull from my childhood. Gadget's there. Nice, nice. So how long did it take to make the ears and your tail? Um, you know, the tail was actually a gift. Um, my boyfriend made it for me last year. Nice. So, um, the ears didn't take me too long, probably, you know, less than a day, and just pr getting the, everything, putting it all together. And it's on a headband, so that's why it's Oh, nice, in there. nice. And what about your goggles? Um, I just bought steampunk goggles online and painted them blue. Nice, nice. Everything's just pieced together, pretty much. Nice, nice. So, what, what do you? What, like, what's one of your favorite cosplays um, that I've seen or that I've done? That you've done. This this one's by far my favorite because I have a giant wrench, <laughs> <laughs> and everyone just gets so excited. They sometimes can't place me, and then they do. They get all excited. People point. Nice. It's a lot of fun. Nice. So, besides this one, what, which was the, the one that took the most to do as a cosplay? Um, well, it'll probably be my new one, which is Vanilla Bee from Wreck-It Ralph. Uh, um, she has lots of little candy pieces that go in her hair, she's a metal, she's a her clothing takes is a lot of different pieces. Uh -huh. She probably took me the most time so far. So that one's the more the more technical one that you had to do so far? Lots of little pieces, yeah. So other than that, a gadget's wrench probably takes one of the longest. <laughs> so what is a wrench made out of? It's a styrofoam that I cut, and then I paper mache it, and then I sprayed it gray. So nice. I'm probably gonna try making a new one and maybe fill it with some kind of plaster. That'll be awesome. <laughs> Next French 2.0. Nice. All right, let's get back to the con. Peace. What's up, cosplayers? And look at who I found, Hannibal Lecter, here, Phoenix Comic Con, 15. So, how's life been treating you, Hannibal? Fine, just fine. Just recently, actually, I found a nice little man in a very good suit. Close to Barbara Simmons. Suit up. Anyway, I found him and I decided to do what I do a while back. I ate his liver with a side of fava beans and a nice QLT. That sounds very, very appetizing. Yes, it was. Um, it was very, how would you say, hmm. Well, as someone like you might say, tasty. So, when are you going to be getting out? I mean, everybody wants to know how long you're going to have in there and when are you going to break out? The moment I'll break out is the moment I break your bones. Um, okay, Doc, Doc, um, I'm getting kind of scared now. Um, okay, we have him all tied up. We got his muzzle on and he's in a straight jacket. I think we're going to be okay. Okay, now, now, do you have him on tranquilizers too or not? I don't think anything can take him down. Always a little mind numbing so he doesn't think his way out of it. All right, thank you, Doc. There you have it, Hannibal Lecter, here at Comic Con 15. What's up, cosplayers? It's your boy Monty, and I'm here with Logan. What's up, Logan? Tell me about your your cosplay right here, buddy. Well, this was only for like Halloween or like, Comic Con. Uh huh. Um, and I, I, my my dad buy it. Uh huh. At the uh, the scary. Scary store. Oh, yeah? I don't know what it's called. Are you supposed to be a zombie? It looks like you got pretty beat up here and here. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, and there's like things on the helmet. Oh, yeah? Can I see? Yeah. Look at all scratched up. Look like you've been in some heavy battles, bud. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah, because uh, uh, Stone Troopers have to be in big battles. Oh, yeah? Ooh. Oh, 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 your head's rolling away, buddy. I got it. <laughs> so stormtroopers have to be in big battles? Yeah, so they can, like, beat the, the good guys. Because they're, they're the bad guys. Oh. They're not good guys. So they have to fight the good guys. 
Yeah. So, so who else do you like to dress up as? Uh, when I was little, Over here, I liked it to jump. I was, I was, when I was a, when I was little, uh -huh. I liked to like be in the, I like to be in the Chewbacca costume, the Darth Vader one. Really? Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah, bro. and I got a little like Choo Choo like Thomas costume. Cool, cool. So you. You can't wait till the new movie, the new Star Wars comes out? Yeah. That's awesome, bud. That's real awesome. Anyone you want to say hi to? Hi. Say hi, Mom. Hi. All right, players, let's get back to the con. What's up, cosplayers? I'm chilling with my mermaid. <laughs> blue? Or I like to call her Blue Moon. <laughs> the Blue Moon, yes. Yes. Rare treasure. Yes. End of day one. Just a lot of people. And it's a good turnoff for day one. It's a good practice run today to get ready for the rest of the weekend. <laughs> so how how you been? How the girls been doing? I'm doing so great and we're not in the water this year but we're nice and in the air conditioner indoors so we can see everyone and I don't know if you can see her later but I have a special new mermaid joining me named Mermaid Pearl. This is her first time out of the ocean and into the public so she's a little nervous but we're happy to have her here today. Nice, nice. I see you brought your pirates with you again. Yes. My pirates have to carry me here and they keep us safe and keep a watchful eye and they've got the ship there and they're helping us do a raffle and do rewards for my new book I've been working on all year. Yes, I won the tote bag. <laughs> oh, did you? Yes. Congratulations. Thank you, thank you. It's not, I like the logo you got on there. Thank you. Oh, those are the nice soft tote ones. Oh, those are soft ones. That's, that's a nice bag. <laughs> Tell me about your book. You've been telling me that you've been wanting to write a book and about your adventures and stuff. So you're going to get your book going? Yeah, I actually have one right here. So this is not the completed book. Okay. Um, we had to whip this one out so that I could read it to the kids tomorrow at my reading. Um, but we're still working on it. There's going to be different graphics, and we might print it differently, but we're just so excited to actually be able to hold something and see our hard work. Um, and it tells just all about the adventures that I've been having and about some of the friends oh, that wow. I've been meeting. There's underwater photos and above water photos. And we've had lots of really great photographers that have helped work on this. And you can see a bunch of my pirate friends. Wow. Uh, some of the Dread Fleet are in there. There's unicorns, there's fairies, and a wizard. Woo, he's really cool. It's very, very colorful. <laughs> it's super colorful. All, we bright, went to some very colorful colors. worlds. <laughs> yes, yes. But it's looking good so far. We just need the magical graphics to appear for us and clean it up a bit. And like I said, we may or may not print the final one this way, but we're so excited to have it and just so happy. I can share it with the kids and I can't wait to read it. And I hope I don't cry when I'm reading it to them because it's finally coming true slowly but surely. <laughs> That's awesome. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you so much. Appreciate so you got a new mermaid. Yes, this is Mermaid Pearl. She's beautiful. You'll have to get some good photos of her, too. <laughs> I will. I will. So how did you meet up with Pearl? Where did you guys meet? Oh, one of my adventures. She just swam up, and there she was. You can ask her about her story and why she calls herself Pearl. And she has a really neat story. But she's new, and I'm excited. She's out of the water and wasn't too afraid to come out today. And all weekend, we're going to have other mermaids with us, joining us, and pi different pirates, and... You have to see everybody. <laughs> nice. We love you. <laughs> what about your Facebook? My Facebook? Yeah, you have to go on Facebook and like us. You can follow our adventures. It's facebook.com forward slash the moon mermaid. And we post where we're going to be next. We do lots of events and birthday parties and many of our events are public. And if so, we'll post that and you can come and see us. A lot of them are free. Sometimes we're at places like the zoo. Mm -hmm, the Phoenix Zoo. We'll be there, uh, I think, um, Halloween. We'll be oh. doing, we're always there around Halloween. Yeah, we love the zoo. And the, we're first Friday sometimes. We like to surprise people and show up at first Friday. And get, get a, everyone gets real excited. They're not expecting a mermaid. We get carted around and throw glitter. <laughs> it's fun. Nice, nice. So you're going to be here for the con. Mm -hmm. You're going to read. Yes, my reading is tomorrow at noon. And then Saturday at 
about 6 or 7 o'clock with the Dread Fleet. I'm going to be in the show with them, oh. the Pirates 101 show. And then what else do we have? Sunday, I'm doing it. It's a top secret because it wasn't listed anywhere. Uh -oh. We're doing a fun jellyfish craft for little kids. Jellyfish? We're, yeah, we're going to make our own take home pet jellyfish. It's going to be fun. So that's in the art room, and that will be Sunday at 1 30. That sounds awesome. That sounds awesome. Come out, come see Blue Moon, <laughs> Pearl, Things Con 15. Hit her up on her Facebook. Come down, having raffles to get the book off the ground. Come on, guys. It's a, it's a beautiful stuff. book. All right, let's go talk to Pearl. All right. What's up, cosplayers? Like I said before, here's Pearl, the new recruit, Blue Moon's new friend. What's going on, Pearl? Not much. This is my first con, so I'm really excited to see everybody here today. How about yourself? It's been a long day, but very cool. I mean, mm -hmm. nice AC and everything. How do you like being on land versus being in the sea? Well, I am much heavier on land, so it's, it's going okay. It's going okay. Yeah? yeah, that's good, that's good. <laughs> so, what do you like so far about the con? I love just the variety of characters. I actually see Goku over there, and I personally love Vegeta because I am slightly familiar with Dragon Ball Z, um, you know, through my travels. So I, I think it's mostly just the characters and meeting lots of people and the children love us so much. That's exciting. Yeah, uh, it's like when you see the little kids light up and everything, it's just amazing. It is, they, the way that they look at me makes me feel really special. And here I am, you know, just an average mermaid, yet I'm putting smiles on all their faces. That's awesome, that's <laughs> awesome. So you've been taking a lot of pictures? Yes, I've been, well, I haven't been taking them, but I've had tons of people taking pictures of me when they're beautiful little children, so that's exciting. You got a, you got any adventures you can share with us? You know, I don't know, just hanging out with like Ariel or Blue Moon or anything mm -hmm. like that? Well, I have plenty of stories, uh, many I can't talk about because they are secrets of the sea, oh, okay. but I did meet uh, Moon Mermaid in the Pacific Ocean where I travel. I have a little uh, home there and I like to go to Australia and then kind of the California coast and that's where I met her. So, you know, she let me know about this event and I said, you know what, I've always wanted to be on land, why not give it a try? It's a lot harder though than I imagined. <laughs> so, how do you like land so far? It's 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 exciting. There's tons more to see, and it, it you don't see much when you're under what you see tons when you're underwater. But when you're born there, I mean, you want to see more. Like like Ariel, everybody knows Ariel. She wanted oh, yeah. to have legs and go out and about, and now I'm doing it. Except I'm in my fin today. I'm in my tail. I'm not. I'm preserving my magical pearls uh, for my legs later. But uh, I'm having fun. Nice, nice. All right, cosplayers, until day two, all right, peace.